Last time on The Walking Dead. Since I can remember, Clem's always been there with me. She taught me to be careful, to be quiet, to be strong, to save the last bullet for myself, to atone when I did something bad, to make the bad people suffer. I always listen to Clem, always, but I've been thinking more. I don't know if she's right every time. She told me to leave her if she got bit. That doesn't feel right. We're doing a lot of bad things to save our friends, to protect our home. And when Clem told me to shoot Lily, I got mad, so mad. either. But I remember all the rules. And the first one is never go alone. longer. Don't let it take over. No, we don't.
something! Sorry about your tongue, but at least you're still alive. You have no idea how happy I am to see you right now. Get the fuck off of me! Are you okay? Yeah, my ass is a little singed, but I'm good. Fuck. You, I was... I was so afraid you... Me too. But we're okay. We're both okay. Lou. What happened to Minnie? I don't know. I lost track after the explosion. Clem! made it. There's more walkers than I can count. The explosion drew them right to us. Stay cool. We knew this would happen. We just have to get off this beach. 
Look! She brought the cart around. Ruby! Willie! Come on! We're getting out of here! There's no end to these little shit! Put them down! Do something! herself killed. Damn right. AJ, go with him. No, I'm staying with you. Thanks, kiddo. We don't know where it goes. Well, we do know there's walkers in the other direction. But... Move it, dummy! I saw his eyes when he did it. I saw the bloodlust in them. What are you talking about? Nothing. 
Go. We're safe, but not for long. Damn it. It's so dark in here. We can't move forward without a way to see. I'll figure something out. dark in here. I'm working on it. It doesn't feel safe. There's too much danger outside. I wish I had a gun. We'll be out of here soon. Another one. Hm. Gotta get home before AJ can play with it. Hmm. Some way to start a fire. If they get in here, I'm going to have to kill them. I don't want to do that. Nice in our room. Just have to get home first. No way we're swimming through that. Wet to burn. Okay. Need some way to start a fire. I saw her on the beach. She was bitten, Ten. So, she'll go to the next place. With Sophie. They can be together. That's good. over there. It's too far. Well, we just gotta... We gotta find something to help us cross. The walkers are getting closer. Don't worry. We'll be home before you know it. If I yank that out of there, it would drift down the river and get caught in the rocks. Could work as a bridge. We just need to go across one by one, and then we'll move the rocks out of the way.
right, which way do we go? Ten, do you see a light down any of these tunnels? You brought this on yourself. Oh! Clem! But it's not too late. Let go! For him, at least. <laughs> Follow us and I sprain your ankle. Follow us after that, I break your leg. I won't let you take him. I won't let you make him a monster. Not any further. Clem! Shh! You're coming with me. None of this should be happening. I'll kill you before I leave her. You did this! You made him this way! You had him empty an entire clip into that woman's head! It was only half a clip. Is this what you wanted? A boy who only sees an answer at the end of a barrel! Look at me! And tell me this is what you wanted! Take this guilt trip of yours and shove it up your ass! Oh, ouch. Strong. I don't care if it was murder. I don't care if it was anything. It felt good. Best feeling I've had in a long time. Maybe ever. Why are you looking at me that way? AJ, listen to me. The, the things Clementine has been telling you. She's wrong. What you're becoming is wrong. Why are you even letting them talk about me like that? Neither of you are listening. Anyone that wants to hurt us should be dead. And I'm not sorry about it, and I'm not gonna feel bad about it. AJ. You know you told me to be like this. You always said surviving was the most important thing. Be strong, be brave, and if I can't stop the bad people from killing me, to kill myself first. Killing Lily made us safe. There's nothing wrong with liking that. I can't listen to this. You think you can change him? Do it then. Talk to him. to stop and expect me to get it. You can't tell me to stop when you know it just confuses me. AJ, listen to me. The world is no. hard, and that you had to grow up in it without knowing any other... I know all about the other. Clementine! said I liked it. Maybe I don't know the right words for what I felt. Aren't you glad Lily's dead? You wanted me to kill her. Aren't you glad I did? It's... it's complicated. Because? Because... Because why? What, Clem? Are you afraid to say you liked it too? You weren't happy firing that gun. You were angry. 
angrier than I've ever seen. I need you to hear me, AJ. You can't talk like this about killing anyone. Even Lily. I've heard enough. It's obvious you can't teach him. <laughs> don't understand who we are. I understand you. I've seen your kind. The world is full of you. I've been you. All you know is violence. Death. He could live a peaceful life, but... But it's like you won't let him! It might seem hard to believe, AJ. I know it does, but listen to me. No one has to die anymore. Not humans. Not walkers! James, this philosophy of yours? This philosophy is what has kept me human! It's what will keep any of us human! It's like you read it out of a book of fairy tales, I swear to God! Where everyone could live in harmony if we all just wished hard enough! Open your eyes, James. The world isn't as simple as you like to make it sound! So what is it then? It may not be kill or be killed, but it's awful goddamn close. <sighs> I'll find my own way. Next time you need help, ask someone else. Clem? What is it? He doesn't get it. Not like we do. Not like I do. Let me help you, Clem. Trust me to tell which people are bad. That I won't ever use my gun because I like it. But only to keep our friends safe. Please, you can trust me to decide when it's right. Okay. Really? You're growing up too fast, AJ, and that... that scares me. But you've seen things and done things no one your age should have to do. You've earned my trust. If you say you won't ever enjoy killing, I believe you. I won't. I promise. Feel that? Yeah, that's the way out. left his mask behind. Come on.
coast is clear. If the shore is that way, then the school is probably that way. Sim was the third. Huh? The day after AJ killed Marlon. You already know Violet and I voted for you to stay. A Sim was the third vote. Wait, that means Omar voted us out? And Ruby? Uh, yeah. Huh. What made you think of that? A Sim said you knew how to survive. He could just tell the school would be safer with you there. I voted for you because I liked you. But his reason, it was better. I just, I just thought you should know. Asim was right. We were safer. We were more scared than we let on when you met us. You made that go away. As bad as Marlin was... He still saved me and AJ, and you nursed me back to health. We owed you for that. Maybe, but even so. If Marlon was still in charge, we'd be taken away to wherever, or dead. Instead, we fought back, because you showed us how. We weren't safe with Marlon, even in his safe zone. We were just hiding. Huh? <gasps> I couldn't believe you were really dead. I had to try and find you. You did find me. Did everyone else escape? Yeah, they're okay. They took the cart and headed back to the school. We're safe, Clem. All we gotta do now is find our way home. Any idea which way that is? I know an old bridge near here. If we cross it, we won't be too far from the school. Well, we were looking for you guys, and I... I thought you might be gone for good. Oh. Shit. I was trying to figure out what I'd do if you were gone. And I realized how goddamn stupid I was about Minnie. For a whole fucking year. I was so wrapped up in losing her and Sophie, I pushed away everyone who tried to care about me. Marlon, Brody, Lewis, even you and AJ, I, I, I tried my damnedest not to care about either of you. And I still couldn't tell you why. I know where you're coming from. After losing so many people, sometimes it's easier to keep everyone at arm's length. And then you wonder why you fight so hard to stay alive. I don't wonder anymore. Jesus, everything's so different now. Me, us, the school. I remember how Marlon described it, and what we were gonna turn Erickson into. It's not the way any of us pictured it. 
How did you picture it? I guess I couldn't. I just listened to what Marlin said. How it would be a home. A real one, but I couldn't really wrap my head around it. My family lived in a trailer. What about you? Where'd you live? I lived in a house with my mom and dad. Fence around it, big backyard. What was your favorite part of the house? I had a tree house in the backyard. I used to take my walkie-talkie up there and play for hours. I'd pretend it was a ship and I was the pirate captain. Or it was an igloo and I was a hunter. <laughs> or a castle, and I was a princess. Really? Like with frilly dresses and a tiara? Yeah, but also a sword. A warrior princess. Yeah, obviously. And that treehouse kept me alive when all this started. That's where I hid. <sighs> you know, Erickson can still be the home Marlin promised. As soon as we get back, We'll start rebuilding. Hmm. It'll be a lot of work, but you're right. It is worth it. Hell, we could even put in a treehouse. We've already got a bell tower. Okay, we'll build a bell tower house. Perfect. After all that's happened, it's still hard to imagine. I mean, we fought for it, defended it. It should feel more like home than ever, but it doesn't. You know what the problem is? That stupid fucking name, Erickson. You want to rename it? <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. We should name it something cool. Threatening, but not like scary. Something that makes assholes go, I should stay away. But not like Blood Murder Knife House. What about the rotting shithole? <laughs> it's accurate and uh, <laughs> kind of cool. Like a rock band. Uh, I'm in. I want to help rebuild our school. You will, Ten. We all will. We can start as soon as we get back. And let's get home to the rotting shithole. Okay, just take your time and keep moving forward. That's far. Really far. Should be able to jump it. It's not that far. Yeah, I think we can. We just gotta be careful not to land too hard.
Mini? What? I did it. I found you. Oh, Dad. My sweet little brother. Come with me. You're dying. Yes. Yes, I am. I'm finally going someplace better. I want you there with me. Where everyone gets to be a, a person again? We're gonna go be with Mom and Dad and Sophie together. It won't be real if you're not there. Ten, look at me. I know that looks like her, but your sister is gone. I'm... You can try to stop me, but I am not going anywhere without you. The night will be over soon. Come with me. No! What the fuck? 
Brooke. How could you do that? I had to. You would never get to see your home again if I didn't. I did it for you. For me. I can't. Ted is gone. That soft little boy who liked to draw, he's gone because of you! AJ saved your life, Vi. You'd be dead if he hadn't taken that shot. You think that's okay? Just gutting down one of our own. I didn't want to shoot him. He was my first real friend. But he was messing up again, just like when he got Mitch killed. So I had to decide. Clemp said I could, so I did. I don't. The monsters are gonna trap us. I know. I'll climb first and I'll catch you on the way down. Come on! Bye! Shit! I got it! Clem, look out! Run! Meet us back at the school. But uh, we'll make it. Go. Clem, we can climb there. Good idea. This first. bit. We can't stay here. Keep moving forward. Keep moving forward. Keep moving. Keep moving forward.
moving forward. Look! James's barn! It's empty now. We'll be safe in there.
Paging. You did it. Now what? You need to find a way out of here. We can climb up there. The monsters can't reach us up there. Let's go. Easy climb. Come on. Please. Try. <laughs> You can't give up. You can't give up. I need you. I need you. <laughs> My little goofball. It's Alvin Jr. You'll always be goofball to me. Hey, look at me. Hey, Jane, please. You're such a cutie. How did I get so lucky? Silly right now. Not right now. Please. I need to make sure you remember. Remember what? The rules. What's number one? Never go alone. So, so I can't leave. Not without you. AJ. It's your rule. You won't be alone. Not for long. Get back to the school. I don't know how. Sure you do. One of the first things I ever taught you. You need to make sure they can't smell you, so... Fresh, juicy walker just waiting to be gutted. <laughs> Grab that axe. You know what to do with it. Next rule. What do we do when the monsters come? Clem. AJ. Shoot them in the head. Got any more ammo? There isn't any more. <sighs> okay then. Fuck. And the last rule. I want to stay with you. I know what'll happen. And, and I don't care. I don't want to go. I just want to sit next to you and... stay. Like that monster couple from the train station. No one would hurt us. Just sitting. Forever. Please. Stay. I know, I just... I had to ask. Last rule. No! What do we do if I get bit? Are you gonna make me see it? 
Just leave. I can't let you turn into a monster. You have to. I'm coming. Junior.
Okay, now, where to? Can't go back to Richmond. This whole area is a war zone. Gotta... Go? Yeah, we have to go, AJ. This place, we can't stay here. It's not safe. But it's okay, we're survivors. The first rule of survival is never go alone. Never go alone. Clem? <laughs> yeah, that's right. AJ?
I know where we'll go. We'll go find ourselves a new home, together. And I'll never leave you again. Fuck you, fish. Uh, fucking shit. Come on. Uh, I give up. I wish you knew how to talk. Fishing's kind of lonely. All right, girl. I'm gonna go put this beer away. Stay here and keep watch. Nothing good. I should tell Willie this is here in case we need more bombs. This place is cursed. Oh, that's scary and mean. I think this place is good. It's getting kind of cold. I'll bring some sticks and stuff next time. Well, looks like a bad place to sleep. No! No, no! Yes! Good girl! Hmm. 
Monsters aren't people. Sorry, Tin. I know. Me too. Let's go home. Let's go home. What you doing there, goofball? Whoa, <laughs> easy there. You're out of bed. You're walking. And, and you have wood arm legs. Crutches. Crutches. I found your hat. It was in the creek down by the shack. I thought I wouldn't get it, but Rosie jumped right in and got it out of the water. It's all wet now.
definitely seen better days. You know what? You keep it if you want it. I'll put it in our room. I have a surprise for you, too. Come with me. I want to show you something. So, what do you think? It's... it's for me? Yep. Willie helped me put it together. Come on, let me push you. <laughs> did you ever get to swing when you were smaller? Yep, sure did. A long time ago. You're the best, Clem. It's gonna get cold! Come on, let's go eat. We're coming! Yeah, that's the spot. A sim says he saw 10, 15 of them, a little bit past the old safe zone. I want you to go. You're the boss. We need to know who they are. Maybe even see if they're willing to trade. Just keep your distance until you can make a call. Who who are? A group of survivors out beyond the old safe zone. Some kind of caravan. Are they bad people? How about you back me up, and we'll find that out together. Word on the street is you're a good running buddy. Best. Sending Violet, Smart. <laughs> 
She knows what she's doing. I got gotcha, you, kid. That's why I want you to come with. It makes me feel a lot better if you went. This is the part where you tell me you'll be really, really careful. Okay? Just... just getting tired. Hey, walk with me a sec. Katja. Sorry. It's okay. I stare at it too. If it was just you and me alone out there, and I was like this, I don't know if I'd make it two weeks. I'm gonna need these to go anywhere. And if we ever had to run... It wouldn't be pretty. At least you didn't lose a hand. You can still shoot a gun. I can. And maybe I'll get good again someday, after a lot of practice. <laughs> All this... It's worth it. All those times you would ask me if we'd find a home. All I could ever tell you was, we'll see. And your face would fall every single time. It's better than saying yes and lying to me. And that's what I told myself. But you want to know something I didn't tell you? I never had a plan. I never knew where we were going. I never knew anything. I just fought and fought and fought and hoped you didn't notice. Hoped we'd find something before you did. Did I do a good job? I mean, I didn't die. That's the job, right? I mean, like, really? Yeah, there were close calls. Not close enough? When we were in the barn, you didn't listen to me. And if you had, I'd be dead. I was right to trust you, back in the cave. To make the hard calls, even when I couldn't. You'll have to be strong for the both of us. You made it so I can. So, thank you. For everything. You're welcome, for everything. Okay, okay, in you go. I wonder who 
who you used to be. It's so cool looking. I wonder if it has magic powers. Nah. I'm coming.